Oh look, it's you. Busy fan, what's happening? Alright guys, as you can tell, I'm in my bedroom right now. <sighs> it has been an incredibly, incredibly, incredibly long day. And... <laughs> I'm going to tell you guys about it in a little bit. Because I'm going to head to bed real soon. And I'm, I'm tired. I'm like extraordinarily tired. So let me tell you guys about it in a little bit and then I'm going to head to bed. Hey fam. All right, guys. So <laughs> I am tired. It has been an extraordinarily long day. Oh, like really, really long. Like I got to go find my charger now because it's somewhere over the rainbow in the living room. Let there be a little bit of light. What the? Oh, it's over here. Yeah, no, it's been a long day, guys. Um, today was kind of... Oh, sorry. Today was... Well, look, today was kind of a chit show. And... It's not to say it was anyone's fault, because it really wasn't. Um, actually, no, it was someone's fault. Yeah, I, I'm going to... I'm going to name them by name. I'm going to call him the weatherman. Because that's whose fault it was. The freaking weatherman. Uh, today was a shit show. Basically, we were supposed to go out and uh, do some things. Well, no, let's start from the beginning. I woke up this morning to huh, an icy tundra. I am not joking. Like, my car, get the remote here. Going out to my car, it was frozen over. Not even snow, just straight ice all over it okay opening up my door huh how it was frozen over like opening my door you can hear the ice cracking just crack 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 open up the damn door getting on the road to work I fishtailed twice mind you I'm going less than 30 miles an hour I'm pumping my brakes so I'm not you know I'm not just slamming on my brakes and whatnot because Excuse me. Yeah, that's right. It is black ice out there. And if you know anything about me, you see this scar in the back of my hand? That's from black ice. I'll tell you about it later. 2010. So, I mean, it's cold. I'm, I'm not even trying to be a weenie. It's freaking cold. We get there. I may be... I get there on time, but I have to use the restroom, so that put me behind by like a minute. But, yeah, whatever. So I was behind about a minute. Oh, let me just, here we go. So I'm behind about a minute, right? And every, we're all caught up after things are issued, people get to their vehicles, yada, yada, yada. You know, everything's caught up. We're good to go. He, the problem is... One of them vehicles uh, didn't exactly sound right. To me, I couldn't really tell. But then again, I'm not a grease monkey. So, I don't know. Uh, so, we have to replace it. Okay? And then after that, I'm, I'm literally, I'm not joking. I'm tired. <sighs> after that, we got on the road. And we get to our, I'll say, our place of business. Tell me why we get out there. And where we're at, we're supposed to be outside mostly. Everything, la di da -di, everything is frozen over. I'm not joking. I couldn't make this up if I tried. Frozen over. Hold on a second. My arm's getting tired. Okay, can you, can you all see me? Perfect. So, again, everything is frozen over. And there's no real, like, place to stay warm except the vehicles. But uh, low-key, I'm not trying to use all the gas in the vehicle, keeping it on and yada, yada, yada with the heat and all that. So we have to stay in this, like, shed type of deal. The problem is the shed is exactly what it is. It's a shed. It's a rickety shed that's frozen over with no electricity whatsoever. It's just a shed. It's cold. And I got some stuff in there that I can't just um, 
excuse me, leave by itself. Okay? Can't. Someone needs to be with it at all times. Um, yeah, so I had to stay out there for quite some time in the cold. And we were supposed to do some stuff out there. Again, I know I'm being very general with you guys um, simply because, well, I, I want to be cautious. So um, we're supposed to be doing some things. The problem is being outside, one, it's freezing. Two, everything's frozen over. So bad weather conditions. Excuse me. And three, I'm yawning a lot now right now. Uh, three, we have an overcast. And here's the shtick. I'm just going to move that. Here's the stick. You can't really see that far. That's one, that's bad. Two, can't really see that's high. Ceiling needs to be at least, what, like a thousand feet to be able to do the event we wanted to do? Uh, sorry, guys. Couldn't do it. And they're saying, well, we might not be able to, to perform this event because, oh, I don't know the weather conditions and we might have to postpone to like July low key this was brought up at like 8 30 an hour into the thing okay let's wait till like 10 10 30 and if nothing happens by then we'll shut this thing down that's kind of a long time to be out there in the cold yet we were guess what time we shut everything down I'd say maybe one-ish out in the cold, in that kind of cold, till one. And mind you, the cold didn't let up. The fog let up a little bit. The overcast let up a little bit. But not enough to where we need to perform the event we wanted to perform. And the cold did not let up whatsoever. I was freezing my buns off. Literally, I was playing uh, Army Running Cadence uh, music on my phone and running in circles to stay warm. Not joking. Literally, I can't make that up. I'm seriously not joking. I was playing, I had my little speaker, my little Bluetooth JBL speaker. I Bluetooth it to my phone. I went on YouTube. I played uh, a running cadence called Rock Steady. And it's one of my favorite running cadences. And I started running in little circles in front of the shed to stay warm. It wasn't, it helped a little bit. It didn't help a lot of it. It helped a little bit. Oh. Excuse me. Oh. Like four yards in a row? Yeah, I'm tired. So basically wasted about half a day. And now to turn in some stuff that I, I was hoping was going to be an easy turn in. No. No. It's going to be a pain in the <laughs> rear. And I'm not a fan. I'm not a fan of today. Today was not a good day. I didn't leave work till like 6, basically. Because I was trying to get, trying to get ahead a little bit um, from tomorrow. Or actually from today, because I can do what I want to do today. So I got some paperwork done. Got an email done that I desperately need to get done. So, again, today, not the best day. I'm not a fan of today. So, I am going to put something on the TV so I can fall asleep too. <sighs> and then, um, time to go to bed. So, I'll be back in a second to sign off. Um, I'm not going to stand up and do this. I'm literally just... I mean, I'm going to go shut the light off in a little bit, or maybe not. I don't know. I'm tired. But I'm going to go to sleep. I have an early day tomorrow. Again, just one of them weekends. It is what it is. But I will attempt to go into tomorrow with a positive attitude. I'll do the best I can. Um, I'm going to see you guys tomorrow. Uh, yeah, just take care of each other. But more importantly, take care of yourself. Out of here.